Hey everyone, it's Steven Scott with the Knowles Wolsey team. Today, guys, we are super excited to do happy hour episode number 13. That's right, guys, it's our favorite time of the month. It's happy hour. We're back downtown where we absolutely love it. We got an amazing restaurant for you today. If you're into great ambiance, amazing atmosphere, and a chef with world-class experience, you're gonna absolutely love Baccio Trattoria. Now, enough of us talking. Let's get inside and check this place out. Folks, you're absolutely gonna love the ambiance in this beautiful little restaurant here. The lighting is sensational. It has a boutique little menu here with authentic Italian food, a terrific wine list. You're absolutely gonna love it. Check it out. All right, guys, so we're back up at the bar here. We're with, with executive chef Will and Steve. Will, thank you so much for having us today. It's my pleasure. Thank you, guys. Yeah, good. So we understand that, uh, that you're originally from Peru. Yes. And now today you find yourself owning an Italian restaurant, Downtown Berry. So begs the question, why Italian food and why Downtown Berry? Well, there's um, a little bit of a backstory to that. Uh, born in Peru, as a young age, mom uh, found a very good job back in Italy. So the whole family moved to Italy. Uh -huh. So that's where all these uh, Italian roots started to uh, develop and why not? And the, and the whole family started to, to grow in Italy. Nice. Um, as a young kid, and loving food all my life. I learned many, many dishes over there. I started with uh, simple things as making an espresso. It's uh, important this, one. Very, very <laughs> important. I had this guy from a uh, very uh, close friend of, of the family from Napoli that taught me how to make espresso with a little hole in between. Yes. It has its own technique, technique and why not. Right. But uh, then again, eating in school every day, Trying different things made me made me very very curious about the food and yeah and so that's how we started and then we moved here to Canada ten years later. Nice and uh, downtown Barry. Uh, what do you how do you find it down here? What do you enjoy about offering? To be of, honest, uh, one of the one of the things that I love about downtown Barry is how close I am to the to the lake. Yes, that reminds beautiful. me so much of the city where I grew up. Nice. Back in, it's called Ostia Lido. Okay. Oh, nice. It's 30 minutes of Rome, but it was just the same distance. And the reason why I moved here was because of my sister. So she uh, she moved here maybe 12 years ago. Yeah. And she was always uh, going to Toronto, following me in every restaurant where I used to work. And I will ask her, why do you come here? Why? What? There's no restaurants in, in Barrie that you come all the way here? <laughs> Every Sunday, well, I like your cooking, and, and she always motivated me to come here and open something until I finally listened 12 years later, and uh, we got together and uh, we opened this restaurant. Beautiful. Well, we're certainly awesome. glad you did. I'll, bet, I'll say so, that's for sure. Um, well, these dishes look like extraordinary here. I can't wait to step into it, but uh, tell me, uh, like, out of these two dishes, do you have a preference? And tell us a little bit about uh, your favorite dishes. Uh, I grew up by the sea, so I love seafood. It's, uh, I will eat it every day. Uh, on the other hand, you always have those days where you want something light, a little bit creamy, something different, so that's why I chose this dish. So the seafood pasta, you can't go wrong. Fresh, uh, fresh seafood, lots of wine, uh, lemon juice, and lots of love. That's mm. the main ingredient on, uh, on every dish that I that I do. That sounds perfect. And this one here, it's uh, it's a spinach and ricotta manicotti with the rosé sauce. Again, uh, lots of wine, fresh ingredients, uh, and lots of love. Nice. Beautiful. Awesome. There was uh, a mutual connection that we have when I originally asked about this place, sort of, I said, you know, how is it when you guys just came to town? And he said, he's an Italian guy as well, and he said, you know what, he said, there's nothing like it in Barrie, and if you want food like Mama cooks it, then this is the place you want to check out. So I think that's a pretty good plug from a guy Absolutely. like that. Absolutely. Um, it's, I feel so proud to, to hear people saying that. Um, as I was growing, in, uh, growing up in Rome, we have uh, my sister-in-law. She, she taught me a lot as well, even until the end, and even here, she moved here to, um, to Canada, and she has taught me a lot of, uh, of Italian cuisine, the traditional, how Nonna makes it, right? right. So I, I can tell that, I can, I can say that I, I have a few dishes, not too many, but the ones that I make, I make them the way they're supposed to be made. Beautiful. Nice. Awesome. That's beautiful. Good. Uh, well, curious now, I understand you've been around the world a little bit. Tell us a little bit about your uh, real estate travels. It's been uh, quite interesting to see how different uh, cities around the world um, 
have this uh, connection when it comes to real estate. All these major developments. I was in Costa Rica, huge development uh, right there, right by the, the tourist area, Tamarindo Beach. Great, great, beautiful place. Uh, I was interested in, in purchasing something, but then I moved here, the family. And another, another, uh, another place that I found really interesting is here, is here in Barrie, believe it or not. I saw such a great growth here in the real estate. Yes. And uh, I think it's something that is, is going to keep going and going. Yeah, I think we're just, uh, just getting warmed up in that department. So yeah. that's, uh, that's what we're hoping as well. Yeah. Lots more coming. Yeah, amazing. Oh, well, lots, thank lots. you so much for having us today. Yeah, thank we're, you. Uh, we're super excited to dive into the dish and uh, grateful you're down here doing what you do. And uh, we're fortunate to have you in the city for sure. Well, thank you awesome. very much. Cheers. 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 Buon appetito. Yeah. Cheers. 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 All right, guys, that's it for this week's episode. Uh, please come down, check it out. Will's doing an absolutely amazing job down here. You won't regret it. And until next month, cheers.